So oh, it wasn't it... a farm tree. No. It was in town. <laughs> well, this guy's just a hooligan, man. Master Gene. Yeah, ma- master you wanted to master tell criminal the story. here. That's what it was, but he fucked up. He's oh. like, bro, you know where I got this tree from? <laughs> the square, the town square. Yeah, the town square. <laughs> <laughs> I give you... respect for my being yeah. on a daily basis. And if there is a God, he will appreciate that. And if there isn't, the universe will appreciate it. Yeah, exactly. That. Just try and not be an arsehole. If it wasn't for the pub- publicity reasons behind it, because it always used to come with the camera crew, but yeah, anyway, yeah, yeah. Um, they would bring <laughs> the, the priest. The whole point is God to see it, in your opinion. Yeah. Yeah. Why you got a camera? Are you ready? People think this just happened. <laughs> They think this just You're ha- born with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. they right. don't realize how long this shit took, bro, and how many the efforts. Uh, how much jail in the beginning and fucking bandanas and trying to bands and fucking you name it, bro. I, at some point I had like three bandanas and three elastic bands just trying to hold everything together, bro. <laughs> before I got here. It was a whole science easy. behind yeah. it. Um, and then you went to school for it and you became a barber. So yeah, hey, bro. you know, life works out funny yeah. sometimes. It does. Um, welcome back to the broadcast show, What's episode up? number 19. 19. 19. Very Almost nice. 20. Wow. Almost 20. We're, gonna we're get, a landmark. Yeah, we're going to get another achievement from Buzzsprout at 25. So yeah. look out for that one. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's start with just addressing the whole new era of the broadcast show. Yeah. Let's say. Uh, well, we, first of all, part of the new era of the broadcast show is that now you have short hair. Correct. We didn't actually we address, did that address that last time. That. Yeah. So that's yeah. Also I have part. short hair yeah. once more. No once one cares. Again. Yeah. I'm no also. Bad. I'm trying to. I'm trying. I'm trying to copy Andoni's look. So this is the early the other way stages around, of that. It's upside down. Yeah, he's saving money uh, to buy fake like, hair. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna. Have no, a, not fake hair. It's real yeah. hair. Oh, well, fair just enough. Just not yours. Yeah, Beaver not yours. hair is as oh, shit, real you and there. indistinguishable. <laughs> you okay. could have gone human. You know, if they say It's you, cheaper. Bro, if they send you skunk hair, you would never know. The, the fact that you know that, that is cheaper. Well, yeah. it must be cheaper. Oh, right? okay. So you don't know. That. I don't know. Oh, I haven't right. researched it, assuming, but I assume. assume. You, you're assuming. So, uh, yeah. So the new era of the broadcast show, uh, episode 18... No. Was done. Oh, yeah. Episode okay. 18 was done by an external editor. Episode 19 mm-hmm. is also going to be done by an external editor. That it is takes a huge a load. Ste- yeah. step for us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes huge a huge step. load uh, off the stress and, you know, the uh, organizing of the show. Me, I mean, let's just be honest. It's taking all the stress and shit off Chris because yeah, we yeah, haven't yeah, been yeah. doing wait, any wait, of this wait, stuff. Wait, wait, wait. You should have seen me, bro. <laughs> Sleepless hours, man. Like, trying to get all the... You the know, because I'm very uh, uh-huh. the nuance. You're yeah. OCD. You need yeah, to make yeah. sure like it's once, all on point. Once the the monitor is on and the computer, right? I'm I'm gone, bro. Like yeah, I'm yeah. there in the flow. Just uh, just a little technical I'm, I'm, question for you. The um, state of flow. I'm bro. Michael what's Jordan. The, of, you know? I understand, bro. What's the program called that you do your editing on? Ed- editor. <laughs> editor <laughs> He's not wrong. <laughs> the, the it is an editor. Three thousand. Editor six hundred. <laughs> It's the new one, bro. I just downloaded it. Did, did, I downloaded it. I down. I downloaded it. You've got this. You've got I downloaded this. it, right? <coughs> and then so. I started editing mm. whatever needed Everything. to be edited. edited. Yeah, you you had to do all the editing stuff, yeah? See? I know what I'm doing. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. So, so uh, I don't have to do that anymore, th- thank God. That had to be done because my work, <laughs> circum- my work circumstances changed. Yeah. I have to put a lot of focus into my 9 to 5. But mm. at least if I do so, it can help with upping the production of the show. So yeah, yeah, it's not time wasted, let's say. We're going to get better. Yeah. So um, And we've noticed that the last couple of episodes with a more open approach to the show of just chatting shit between just us mm-hmm. on a specific being s- on a on general a th- subject yep. actually works so a uh, notice i want to give the crowd is if you hear any explosions throughout this episode no- nothing's wrong Don't we're not in a war yeah, yeah yeah it's easter uh, where we're from it's yeah. easter day and yeah. part of our culture and r- Religion biggest holiday and, yeah. and it's the biggest holiday um what a celebration of our culture yeah. is to blow things up wait i mean wait. not really wait bro what? What? it's not, it's not part say, of the religion you know you can say that oh right? yeah but someone but, listening yeah yeah but when like you need to specify what you're if, blowing up here if you looked like us and we said that 
everyone would assume NSA would be on our asses. You can't say blowing up, right? Yeah, it's yeah. just a it's a toy. It's of not sorts. It's a homemade which explosion. Which has became become too much of a toy, and now it's it's an explosive. It's dangerous. It's, it's dangerous. It's, it's a little yeah. bomb. And in our Tiny. culture, when we were kids, we would basically throw them to each other. Mm -hmm. But you know, you got to be careful with the bigger ones. They're like yeah. sort of homemade, customized fireworks that explode. Firecrackers. 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 I think yeah. Firecrackers. What they're called. Yeah. You remember that uh, scene in Toy Story? The big one. The yeah. big one. Yeah. 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 Like we, all, we all had a friend that carried the big one. Bro. I think they're called the Magnum at the we time. We had Matrix, Magnum, TNT. Yeah, let's not endorse any. Yeah, 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 yeah let's yeah, stop yeah. there. I know all the names. Yeah. We're talking I, about Magnum I, I, ice cream. I never got involved. I never, I never got involved. Yeah. Yeah. No, it, it's a good choice. Yeah. Good choice. We spoke about this on the last they, episode. They scarred me at school, that's why. Yeah, they, they come at school and they show you all this the stuff. The police we, we comes spoke about that, yeah. and they give you a whole... The, yeah, every year thing. the police comes and they They, they give you a whole you, safety speech. They give you a whole speech with a fucking and they traumatize presentation. You. Yeah, presentation. Yeah, they, they show you these images of like... I think in some schools... People's fingers and things missing yeah. because of them. You I know? think in some schools they will take some of these people to talk. Yeah, man. Uh, these people with the missing limbs. I haven't heard you know? that, but wow. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. I mean, the pictures work, so that definitely would have worked. <laughs> yeah, imagine. But, you know, it's fucked up because they do it whilst you're in church. They do it whilst you're... They, just they do it especially at church. I live behind the church, basically. Yeah, yeah. And last night, I thought it was a war zone. Yeah, Like, no, it was crazy, crazy bro. Did crazy. you hear what happened to those kids? They, they got arrested. So, another tradition that they do is they basically gather a bunch of wood... And each village has to make a fire, a bonfire, right? Yeah, we burn the Judas. Yeah, and that's for Jesus is. Oh yeah, it's representing Judas. Yeah, right, right, right. Yeah. yeah. So they, this has become a tradition, and it's basically a competition now, village versus uh, village, another village, yeah. whoever has the biggest pile of wood. Yep, yep. Biggest. So fire. these kids got arrested two days ago for cutting down protected trees over three hundred oh, year, no. years old. Shush, I didn't hear about this. No, yeah, wow. bro. Yeah, bro. an olive on. tree too. Olive like, just oh, yeah, no. yeah, yeah, yeah. an olive tree where we are is like a sacred tree. Yeah, for yeah. Us. they have title deeds. Yeah, I'm not L even joking. Literally, I'm. They have yeah, they title do. No, deeds no, no. just They've like a rights. house in the car. Yep, got yep. rights, bro. Yep. So yeah, they cut down some 300, 400 year old trees and dickheads. Oh, bro, that so is ridiculous. A twenty two year old guy is in prison now for the for cutting the wrong tree. I mean, I don't feel sorry for him. Bro, just go get some scrap wood. Seriously. Why are you cutting trees for? There's so much scrap wood but, around. But especially... And it's so an much more tree. effort. It's so much more effort to you know cut the tree. fucked up, bro. I mean, it burns, it, well. It's the area that it was. I think it was in the, the old town. Where it's like our centre. <laughs> it's not like... <laughs> oh, it <laughs> wasn't it? a farm tree. No. It was in town. <laughs> Well, this guy's just a hooligan, man. Master genius. Yeah, ma master he wanted master to tell criminal the story. Here. That's what he was, but he fucked up. He's oh. like, bro, you know where I got the tree from? <laughs> the square, the town square. Yeah, the town square. <laughs> <laughs> Dickhead. Dickhead. So, yeah. So, but yeah, man. Seeing as it's Easter, uh, we thought like we'd approach the religious aspect of things a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, we're not, we all grew up in a religious country. Yep. Let's. Start there, I guess, yep. right? Very religious uh, country. Christian Orthodox yep. yeah. well, is our country. They went through phases throughout the last thousand years of different occupancies where it was a fight between Muslim and Christian, right? Yep. Right? Basically, there wasn't yeah, yeah, any yeah. other religion coming in, was oh, there? No, these yeah. were the main At ones. At the time, yeah. They're, they're the Unless you ones. want to go really far back. No, no. Let's say it stayed last 500 years. Yep. Yeah. Those Big were the fight ones. between the two. Christianity prevailed in... This is where where we grew up. Now, Orthodox Christianity is very strict. Mm -hmm. I don't think uh, Catholic people understand no. uh, the di the how difference. Much yeah, difference how much there difference is. there is. But the similarities are a lot, but the differences are more. Yeah. So we used to be taken to church in, uh, by the school uh, on a very frequent basis. Yeah, yeah. Walk yeah. the streets. Remember yep. that. See. Where we come from, uh, anything that's got to do with religion is more like your birthday ain't important, but your name day is. Yes, yeah, big, yeah. big you thing. Know, yeah. I never celebrated it though. Yeah, at, no. at the office, they don't. They they used to bring uh, treats on their name day, not their birthday. Yeah, now it's both. By the way, your name day is associated to the saint that you've been uh, yeah. named, named after. after. Yeah, 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 right. Yeah. So hold on, on the name days, yeah. What's right? Are you taking? 
chocolates to everyone yeah, else. Yeah, yeah. Have they bring into no, you? Like that's again with our culture. Even yeah. on our birthdays in our culture, we, take, we buy we everything. Take, yeah. In other cultures, it's let's the say in the UK, you, if it's your birthday, you pay for nothing, Man, bro. It's yeah. Everyone else sorts you yeah. out. Here it's my which birthday, is, I'll take you so out. Which makes so much more sense. It does. But over here, we're large, isn't it? We're we think, large. We so think I will we provide for 200 people. Yeah, it's it's tonight. my birthday. I'm going to take you bro, out. Bro, I've spent I'm hundreds. Get animal crackers uh, over for them. the years, you get a donkey. my dad paying for my birthdays and then me as an adult is combined is thousands. Yeah, of course. Thousands yeah, yeah, of yeah, birthdays. Yeah. Yeah, but that's part of it. It's, yeah, uh, it's I fun. like it. You know, I like when I used when we used to be in the restaurants. I used to enjoy watching them fight. The two men fight over oh, who's, who's going to pay. pay the yeah. full amount. Yeah, fuck sharing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like they were. Sometimes they would get physical. Yeah, like, like pushing like, what, what, and shoving. Like well, no, I'm going to pay. One guy's like, bro, I've got one me. kid. You've got seven. Yeah, it's like doesn't matter. I'm paying. I'm bro. paying. Like, I'm paying for your seven kids. Doesn't matter if yeah. it doesn't make sense. No. No. All the men want yeah. the, the worse, the better. The more the bill was, the better they would feel yeah, about yeah, themselves. Exactly. Yeah. And they I do the whole, 300 the whole, bucks the whole I'm going to go to the toilet trick. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They all do it. And yeah. they all clock each other. Yeah, so yeah, they all yeah. know what happens. Uh -huh. Then you ask for the bill. No, you're fucking not going to the toilet. Yeah. No, 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 no. I'll come with you. You better pee right here, bro. <laughs> you better pee right here. You're going to sneak off and pay the bill. What the? <sighs> yeah. Yeah. So, well, I've seen arguments from the opposite side of that at the bar where where, you know, to people that aren't from here, yeah, <laughs> will be like, "Hey, you owe me a euro, mate." Like, yeah, yeah. what the fuck? I, I covered the large water. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, we both drank <laughs> from it. You had a glass yeah. of the bottle of That's water. Thirty-three cents of water you yep. just had. Crazy, yep. bro. Crazy. I'll, I'll round it down for you. It's okay. That is crazy. That's bro. how they feel good. I'll yeah, round yeah, it. Yeah. I'll round it down. But yeah, so I, my first memory of my big fight with religion it started when. Um, they used to take us to church and at some point, I can't remember what grade, I decided, you know what, I don't want to walk inside anymore. Mm. I don't want to, I, I don't want to go stand there for an hour, an hour and a half, listen to this and breathe all of the, because there was a certain musk to it as well, bro. Uh, you it know, would get to you, you know you'd funny. get a bit high after a while. You know, you know? what's funny, bro? Even though you have that, that, rationa mirror. that rationality at that age, rational brain mm. you just described as a young age to make a decision yeah is it you, your choice of the opposite choice would be to stand outside with coffee and cigarettes no at the time i wasn't smoking i'm saying oh, like yeah. from 14 15 years old right you know, no this happened younger are oh, you talking like when you're I'm six talking, or seven uh, uh, primary school right i just right. don't know what what grade? Probably twelve um, or some shit. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. yeah, and they would go at me, bro. They the teachers. They would go at me. They would be like, "You can't. You physically, I can't physically let you stand outside the church. You have to go inside." Then you tell and, her about I'll burn. No, and to me, it was just the argument of you 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 can't force me to do this. Yeah, mm. as a as a human being, like it doesn't make sense that you, you have the force power your to force this on me. Yeah. So that was my problem, not yeah. anything else. You know what I mean? So for a few years, um, it started then and then till my early 20s, I would say, I had a big thing against religion. Now uh, you're good. No, now it's changed a little bit. Yeah. It's more open-minded. It's more, oh, I see your point a little bit. My it's view more, on you know, the whole religion thing is, I mean, I... I don't believe in anything really. Specific? No. Okay. I believe more like in the universe and those sort of forces, mm -hmm. natural forces, rather than what we call God in whatever religion. Yeah, so you don't see an intentional plan? No. Well, no. I think everything's connected. Like we're all made yeah, yeah, out of the yeah. same, you know, everything is one, let's say. Mm -hmm. But um, not because of some celestial being in the sky that's deciding mm -hmm. our fate and yeah. judging us on everything we do. But that doesn't mean because I don't believe in religion that I don't believe that we should have a code in life. I like, think that's yeah. just a naive understanding that we have, the first degree understanding that we have from religion. But I think if you if you look at the universe and religion, it's actually one. It's combined. And I, I just, I, I don't like taking the stories that they give in religion as uh, like exactly how you should, or literal, let's say, yeah? Like whatever don't it says, this. yeah. Because if you actually go and read the Bible in our case, mm -hmm. yeah, there's so many things in there that like today you, like would be crimes. I'll give yeah, you an like example you wouldn't be able what to I, do. What, what I, what, maybe what you're trying to say. So, 
like yesterday we had to go to church, right? Mm -hmm. Normally. Supposedly. Supposedly, yeah. 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 I don't. I had the phone call from my mum. She's like, next year, listen, this year, all right, but next year. No, Coming no. to church. No, no, they've given up I'll on me right. now with this. I'll, prom I'll go next year. I'll pro yeah. I promise that. <clears throat> but this is the thing. Uh, maybe what you're trying to say is, so forget the word God and all of that and religion. Yeah. Just, just, you know, look up and, mm -hmm. or down or look, yeah, and be good with whatever's out there. Be mm -hmm. grateful, thankful. So you've made your peace with God, Yeah. right, or whatever you want to call it. And I don't have to go to church because I I'm here. Religion, uh, God is here. I love whatever it is. Church. That energy you're describing from the universe is that is here. It's, you don't yeah. have to go somewhere. You don't have to compare clothing. You don't owe anyone money, according to Bill Burr. No, exactly. You know? I mean, you don't. I don't feel like I have to go into. Yeah, a these church are man-made rituals. Yeah, I, I think it, exactly. you know what else it could be. It's a it's show. Also, man. it's a thing like I went. Where were you? Yeah. yeah it's, it's, you know, it's a human way of. It's, I'm better than you. It's what we said the other day off the podcast is it's the community thing because as a species, yeah, as we supposedly, you know, be yeah, a we're group. social. We have to live. So at some point, you all got to get together mm -hmm. and the church is a good place to do it. Yeah. Basically. Where yeah. were you? Yeah. Where were you? Yeah. Where were you? So um, I was at home. I, I'm good. I made my peace. Like I, I said, my I was grateful. I yeah. said what I had to do in but my head. But what like, you just described, yeah. and I'm going to be a bit hypocritical here. I don't like using labels. Uh, in today's world, they love using labels oh, on yeah. things. But it's, and misunderstand the whole label. By yeah, the way. yeah, because it's easy to mis misinterpret the label. It's like mm -hmm. the whole woke thing. Yeah, that took a twist on us. Yeah, exactly. So what you're leaning towards is the agnostic side of things, right? Mm -hmm. Look, I don't know, so, you know, but I'm still gonna do my part. Yeah. I don't know, but I don't know, right? I give you, respect for my being yeah. on a daily basis. And if there is a God, he will appreciate that. And if there isn't, the universe will appreciate that. Yeah, exactly. That. Just try and not be an arsehole. That yeah. should be your motto yeah. in life. Yeah. Just be a nice person yeah. as best you can. You're, yeah, right? le you're leaning more towards the um, uh, the atheist side. Yeah. I'm not, again, not complete label. But from on your side, what I've seen, uh, what you just said is mm -hmm. do good. Because if you're going to take the scientific side, then you have to look at waveforms, right? Mm -hmm. And positive attracts positive and yep. negative attracts well, that's negative. What I'm saying. The... It's been proved by science. So when you look at science and religion and you combine them at the end of the day, it's all the same shit. It is you know? because, but the, 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 the religion is a, uh, the way they do it is they simplify and they give you a first degree yeah, for explanation. The and that's where you misunderstand and you take the whole thing to, and that's what people, that's why, that's why most people become atheists because they just don't want to believe in stories. Like if you do this, this is going to happen. Mm -hmm. It's basically the laws of physics it translated in, a story. in, wo in words. In yeah. a story. In just a fictional story. That's, why, that's you how said. I see it. The, the fictional story. Yeah? yeah. So the guy, the good Samaritan mm -hmm. that went and helped and missed three and times, whatever the story in a lot is. Of smaller degrees. You're supposed to just get the message out of the story. Yeah. yeah not yeah, 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 not yeah. the literal things that is everything Bro, that yeah. you need to not do step only by that, step. The, the biggest argument is who delivered the message? Did you get the message? Did you get the Forget message? Forget who delivered yeah. the message. They, they, right? There's wars about the who delivered the, the message, the bro. Message like, is the same. Yep. You know? Yeah, the message is the same. Do Honestly, good and like, in every single religion. It's the same. Yeah. Don't be an arsehole. Well, That's they, basically the message. The OG religions. Yeah. The, yeah, the yeah, OG, yeah. The, not the modern, because there's a lot of modern stuff bro, out there. Do you that remember the one? Uh, you do, shouldn't be doing. Do you remember the one? Uh, bro, we had to Google it. Pastafarians. Pa Pastafarians. Do you remember? Oh, yeah. Remember they wear a shit? colander on their and head. And there's pastafarians and they believe in yeah. the fucking meatball god or what uh, god or... The Cthulhu. flying spaghetti monster. Anyway, Cthulhu? it was fake. No, no, Cthulhu, it was fake, but one. it did exist no, 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 on the no, no, internet. No, no, no. It's just... Why is it fake? <laughs> well, there, that's the point of the why, guy who made it. Why is it fake? The point of the guy who made it was that. Yeah. Like, it's as real as any other religion, yeah, as far yeah. as anyone's you concerned. You have a cross. I have a... He believes as deeply in that. Yeah, but my cross has got DNA, bruv, and there's, you know... Anyway, yeah, you know, in his piece, head, that's yeah, how it goes. Yeah, yeah. You know, there's also um, Jediism, Jed Jedi's Jediism from, What's the, from Tom Star Cruise Wars. Believe Scientology. In Scientology. Scientology. Yeah. 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 We're not dissing any religion. If no, you no. found religion, I'm very happy for you as yeah. long as you're happy with yourself. Yeah. My brother's But my only bro. problem with if religion it makes you a better person. Good on. Yeah, yeah. But my problem with religion and religious people in generally when they're too hard on this is when they. When, when they try and yeah, don't preach it. Don't if you found what makes you happy. But and again, what, bruv, again, that person has a pure 
intention I with a naive that. way of delivering because he's not at that level okay. to deliver something so so powerful and important to someone, right? That's the problem. If you preaching. found religion, it's something that you feel inside you, okay? It's not something that you can just convince me to, to feel. Yeah, but right? but Look, in their naivety to, and the purity I, of their heart, they think they can. So uh, their, best, soul, their, be, like their best example is my stepdad. Yeah, he was big no on religion, bro. Like big, big no. I know about your stepdad, you know? and he. I found no. out that he was not only one of the funniest people around; he was also like the opposite of <laughs> of <laughs> the religion. Yeah, big time. Big, he was big the time. guy. Like he was. And about what close to a decade ago, I don't know, maybe five to ten years now, um, he found religion. About right? Ten. So it's my. Dad I don't know. Though. It's it's been some time now. Um, he found religion. The first few years, bro, he was like a little child, excited to talk about it. Mm. You know, because he just found it. He just learned about it. He yeah. just he's excited about it. I just learned this today. I read this for the first time today. This is, so he was, you know, the, but he's quite a heavy personality. Yeah, yeah, So yeah. it would come off as preaching yeah. 99% of the yeah. time. But that died down slowly, These slowly. These strong-minded you know? people. Yeah, you know why it died down, bruv? Because it's he wasn't happen- getting the reactions. It's happened to me with other stuff that I was passionate about, where you think that if you talk in a certain volume, not you think, that's what happens to you, that you're delivering a hundred percent, and that people are actually listening, and and then you realize, oh, no one's actually listening to yeah. me. So they're not as excited fact, about this. In fact, uh, Pe- as I am. Uh, Jordan Peterson says, if someone doesn't li- listen to you, stop talking. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just because then, then, then you just get annoying. Yeah, you know? you're just annoying. If you see, like, it's fine to talk to someone about these things if they've expressed some sort of interest in it. Yeah, man. All right. Ask but, a question. Yeah, but don't just randomly come up to me and start preaching to me about God and your religion and whatever you believe in. Yeah. Like, like I said, I'm happy for you. Well done. Don't preach your shit yeah, on me. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. good the way I am. You know, I believe in what I believe. Yeah. Plus, in the world we come from, imagine how awkward it would have been if a guy with dreadlocks stands in the Orthodox Church. <laughs> well, it's it's a little bit. They'll, I think, it's a very new concept. You'll get looks. They learn to appro- they appreciate it though at yeah. some point. Yeah, you know, you, you'll get looks to, though. Like, yeah, what the yeah fuck? definitely get the looks. Oh, bro, that happens bro in you're going with a white coffee suit, shop. You're gonna wait. You get lo- looks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like never mind your hair. Uh, another person that's really Steve extreme. Steve Harvey, with, uh, who's walking in with a white suit? Is people go with white suits <laughs> to places, bro. Yeah, it's, it's a thing. Okay. Like Colonel Sanders. Yeah. Anyway, um, <laughs> Kentucky Fried Chicken eating motherfuckers. They were there. Uh, right? yeah, I didn't want to go there, but we went there. Let's go. Anyway, um, anyway so another extreme yeah. example is someone I know. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's a lot older than me. He's like sixty-five now. But okay. uh, when he was young, like he's a He's now he's a Jehovah's Witness, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Uh, but to by the book, like religiously, <laughs> he yeah. follows it religiously. Yeah. Okay. Ba-dum-tch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but when he was a kid, bro, I'm talking about the, the total opposite: going out, dancing, drinking, girls. He was like uh, partying hard. He was in theaters. He was in acting. He mm-hmm. was in method acting. He's even on. You know, there's a movie on Netflix, Full Metal Jacket. Yeah, he's mm-hmm. in it. Okay, there's a he's scene. Of, show that's something. a huge film. Yeah, yeah, I know. He's he's actually in it. He's one of the colonels. Uh, just for a minute, but yeah, he, yeah. he actually got to a certain level. Uh-huh. And then, like, oh man, so many things happened. He almost lost everything to drugs, but he didn't quite get addicted. But he was close. Mm-hmm. He kind of saved his life with. You know, religion yeah. turning into religion. Now, did he save it in his opinion? Yeah, but if if you know, if he feels like he was going his, down a dark path, if you ask part. his brother or his mom or this and that, they they'll have a little bit of a different. Maybe it didn't save him. He just should have just calmed down a little bit, and he would have been fine. Like, but he he went from this extreme it, to it the other. It kind of sounds to me like yeah, he's replaced one kind of addict. Addiction, addiction, yeah, or with like another extreme, something, something to really extreme. focus on yeah. and put all your attention. Yeah, in. so on that, which is a positive it, thing in yeah, that yeah. sense. You, well, know, you mentioned replace brother, a bad mother, habit with a better yeah, one. You mentioned brother, mother, all that is because I, I know it from myself and my brother. Mm-hmm. I'd rather him that than the other. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. So at yeah. least that gives you a lot of solace. Uh, it gives you a lot of comfort. Exactly. To be like, Look, exactly. You know, and it, if you fuck that second one up as well, well, it's on you. It don't right? matter. So I, I'm jealous of these people, the religious people, because yeah. the ones that really feel faith, 
you know, like they're happy with their life. The ones that it actually helps them. Yeah, yeah. like good. Yeah. All right, not the ones that use it as an excuse to feel superior to others. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you get a lot of them as well. Yeah, of course. But the ones that really feel it, and you know, and they're truly, truly yeah. religious. I feel, you know, I feel jealous of them. Yeah. Because I don't have that. I don't do have that. something that I can, like, whatever you tell me, I, I'm gonna know from the deepest part of my heart that. Yes, this shit's real. Yeah. I believe in it with all my heart. You know, yeah, when I die, I'm sorted out. You know, you know what I was. Thinking, I don't know none of that. You know what I was thinking the other day over the thousands and thousands of religions that have passed through mm -hmm. our time. Uh, one of them was some worshippers, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. Well, the Egyptians had Ra. Ra. Well, think mm -hmm. about this, bruv. So you one know, many, let's many take books. a little bit of everything. Yeah. Let's take sun. Let's take Rastama, uh, Rastafarian. Let's take all all religions. Yeah. And what what is, let's just put it in one bubble. Let's call it as just as cheesy religion. as it sounds. Let's call it love. Okay. All right. Uh, Think about it. Positivity. Right? Let's call it love. I don't know. Yeah. So, yeah. uh, because what's the opposite of evil, bro? Oh yeah, love. It's love. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Evil like, is yeah. good. Yeah, but yeah. what's good? Love. Yeah, like, yeah, actual yeah, yeah. love. Yeah, 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 like, that's yeah, yeah. the that's actual, the purest form the, the of pure, good. Yes, the purest yeah. form of good is love. So. Take all of that and think about this, bruv. Uh, sun worshipping makes so much sense to me Yeah. In, on a first degree because, well, uh, like George Carlin said, other than the, you know, occasional skin cancer, but <laughs> at least we don't need to learn any songs <laughs> and gather up yeah. somewhere and compare clothing. Yeah. Anyway, so he says, uh, yeah, that, that's what he said. But um, think about this. What, what, what's a, a really good way of describing love? As a what feeling? A warm, warm. feeling, mm. right? A warm feel. Anything warm. Warm and lovely. Yeah, fatty. something warm. You know, oh, it makes me feel warm. You yeah, hear yeah, a lot yeah, of people, yeah. you know. So the sun, warmth, love, uh, all these other pieces, this, I mean, that, you know, nature. Makes the this whole This is what world. the universe and yeah. religion should be just in one bubble. Just call it love. Everyone worship love. And when I say love, I don't mean sexual love. No. But sexual love is a branch of love. Mm -hmm. That's another thing because that actually sets things into place. You shouldn't be banging around without loving and you shouldn't be. So I think love, just call it love and everything, everything is going to be all right. Yeah. If you think about it. Uh, but love is just a product now. You know? yeah, yeah, now yeah. it's just, just like a selling a point, a name. A... Not love though, is it? No, no. Bro, if you name, lust. they're naming their dogs love now, yeah. bro. Like, yeah, 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 a, yeah. People need to learn the difference between love and lust. It's very different. Yeah, that's one's a big physical, one. Here's another, another one I discovered emotional. when I was very young. You ready? Yeah. You can only hate someone you love. It's a thin it's, line, yeah. It's the opposite. You can only so hate same. someone, truly hate someone. Like it's, it's, hate them. it's the yin and yang. Mm -hmm. If you've loved them. Yeah, it's the yin and yang <laughs> of that version. It's, you know? when, when so there's I feel yin, nothing there's for my exes. Yeah. No yeah. love, no hate, fuck you. That means, yeah, you don't care. That means no. that's not true love. You never you, cared. No. But if you actually, you only hate that person you actually really loved. Oh man, Kiri's other side is coming out again. Yeah, the evil side. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah so I mean, sun worshippers, you know, idol worshippers, or at the end of the day, I approach it from I don't know shit about shit. Nope. At the end of the day, <laughs> nothing. I know nothing. <laughs> what, what do you know? Nothing. Literally nothing. <laughs> and that's Literally the, and that's nothing. The, that's the best thing you should do. You and should when, know that you know nothing. And when yeah. you know nothing, you you just... You can start to learn. You can have it's the like faith. This guy says, like, what if I worship the wrong God? <laughs> <laughs> ah, bro, I gave all like my energy all by shipping over here, bro. <laughs> I thought I was going to... I was through it. They said uh, yeah, it was yeah. real. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah, it's If I was to... I mean, I know you can pick a religion anyway at yeah. any point, but yeah. if I was to pick a religion for myself, uh -huh. the mo the one I would feel most um, connected. suited to, connected to, uh, would probably be uh, Buddhism. Mm. Yeah. Right? Okay. I've got the hair down, right? Yeah. I'm halfway there. Halfway there. Yeah. yeah. They're more I think it's meditative it and a lot universe your... and nature. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. It I feel more connected a lot to more that. more with uh, nature. Yeah. I'd rather... Yeah, if I mean, I'm not going to pretend like I know everything about Buddhism. I no, it, know it, it's, it's that Asian... Uh, um, it's Eastern, a spiritual. It's that Eastern aspect of it uh -huh. that they connected spiritual and natural. Yeah. Not, not how with a story necessarily, be. right? Yeah. 
And if, the sto- if, and if there is a story, there it's is a story a of a bird yeah. doing something, or yeah. it's a story of it's an animal doing something. It's examples of nature, yes. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Right. Uh, I think that comes a lot from farmers, though, because a lot of the sayings that are on point come from farmers. The early bird uh, catches, the catches the worm, right? Mm-hmm. It's a farmer thing, and it's absolutely right. Yeah. You know? Uh, there's so many of them. I can't think of any other ones off the top of my head, but yeah. Um, but if you were a farmer, you could. Yeah. So if you're a farmer, leave some comments. By the way, let's remind people to like, subscribe, follow us, listen to us on yes. your favorite audio platform like Spotify or Apple Podcasts. Yeah. Um, we're going to be changing a couple of things in the near future. Hopefully, you're enjoying the episodes. Let us know if you uh, don't. Yeah. Let, Let us, us know. know if there's something you would and recommend for yeah. us. And I would like to, mm-hmm. you know, point out the fact that, you know... Um, Rastafarism. Pastafarism? Rastafarism. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. And uh, is the newest religion established. It's, uh, it's a new religion. No, I think it's the newest. Okay. Yeah, I is think it? it's, it's the newest. I'm, I'm sure there's no. every day popping no, up. No, legit. You know. It's well. the newest legit... Uh, Whatever. What's okay. legit to you is not legit to someone else. Yeah, but I'm else saying so it's forth. registered. Yeah, okay. Right? It's the newest registered. They have rights. Yes. yes. Yeah, okay. Uh, They're Selite. recognized yeah, it's as recognized. a religion. Fair Aile enough. Aile okay. is 1930s, cool. something like that, yeah. Yeah. The King of Kings, whatever. Ja. Um, ja. Yeah, Rastafari. But for them, bruv... Uh, Cultural appropriation. The, 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 re- the reason is that you can't... You can't... Um, Live in a functioning world. No, uh, in a Western society. No, it's yeah. very difficult yeah, to, yeah, yeah, yeah. to practice but the religion. You could say the same as you, Buddha, the, the Buddhism, the same as Hinduism. Yeah, I was gonna say, say for a lot of them, a lot for of religions. Lot, yeah, yeah, like, of course. Because so, wait, the world I'm, was I'm a very different a place. I'm getting yeah. to a point. So, funny enough, the Western world mm-hmm. thinks the easiest religion. Very what was that? <laughs> it picks the easiest religion. <laughs> But I think that's the point we made in the, the beginning. That you can, you know, you can bend it a little bit more. Yeah. But I think that's the point we made in the beginning of uh, that's the Catholic version of mm. it. It's not the one we grew up with. I was mm. was cr- strict. I think our generation felt the leniency, but our fathers, they were not. You know, it was no, not it an was easy just, thing. Listen, I living call- under our religion. I think our religion was very. Yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, we what, bent it. Yeah, you we know, bent our it. generation bent it. Yeah, yeah, uh, for sure. not our parents or our grandparents. The Catholic Western Christianity, yeah, that's been bent for generations mm-hmm. since the Crusades. You bro. know, like, do you think that since religion's dying out or getting getting no, stronger? No, it's coming back, bro. Yeah, I think it's shifting geographically. Is it yeah. moving from one place to the next? Uh, forget it's the West. Shifting. Forget the West. Uh, the West forgot West about religion. Fun. Yeah, but it's is here. It just comes to pure numbers. Forget religion. Forget everything. It's got to do with how many people exist, right? Yeah. And if you see the well, yeah, the, the biggest repro- populations are not well, in the if West. If you see the reproducing numbers of an average family in the Western world, is mm. like comes down to like one point three, right? Uh, if yeah. you're lucky. If you're lucky. Who are these people it, getting like a, a third other, of a baby? It, Abortion. <laughs> no. That's, that's dumber than me, bro. Like, uh, one point three. It's the average. I, oh, oh, yeah. Okay, I got it. Now, <laughs> now you the, okay. Are you ready for the for the that's the for the um, Christian world? Yeah, yeah. Western, right. Yeah. But for the Muslim world, it's seven point three. Something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Good labor force that. <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. I'm saying that's what you used to have a lot of kids for in any yes, part of the world. That is correct. To use them for your labor. Yes. Because most were, most people were farmers and things like that. Correct. And you needed farmhands. Correct. Yeah? Yeah. No racism or whatever no. intended there. Facts. Facts. Yes. Wait, our, our no fathers. racism intended or no actual in, in racism? Case, no, in case no. some people got a bit yeah, of racism. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not his fault, yeah. you know? No, I was just spitting out facts. Yes. This yeah. is how it yeah. used yeah, to be. My grand- the same here as well. My granddad has how, how many kids? Yeah. 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 My, right. my family, my granddad, there was like five of them. There you, you go. You know, and that was, that was just average. Imagine That wasn't even a high. Imagine yeah. telling an American in New York, have five kids. My, he's yeah, going yeah, yeah, yeah. to be uh, stupid. Uh, like. My nan, my nan mm-hmm. it, she's got nine brothers. There you sisters. go. Point proven. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And they all worked from a young age. All of them. There all, you go. Every single one of she them. She came out go. of school when she was f- six. There you go. 
to six. work to look after the youngers. Yeah. Imagine my, that. My gra- six. My granddad. <laughs> she was the oldest. My granddad. He he said to the one son, "You're staying home." Because you're not smart enough for school. Yeah, yeah. And he sent the other one to school. Yeah, let's not waste your potential yeah, here. You, you farm here. the land. Let's go. Work the land. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You have a brain. You have yeah. a bit of a brain. Let's let's I'm not going to waste together. your time with or you my wrote. money, my coins, well, yeah. my shil- uh, sh- shillings. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah like w- f- one coin, time. man, for your mortgage. My, like, I remember my granddad fuck. telling me he used to get five cents a week. And he was good. He could eat. Yeah, you know? yeah, imagine that. Yeah. Yeah. But funny enough, oh, just... being on religion today, or our granddads and great granddads, mm-hmm. uh, or not our granddads, but great great. No, my great, my granddad. No, no, I'm talking about the ones that were under the the Muslim occupation okay, when yeah, yeah, our yeah, country yeah. was under uh-huh. the Muslim um, uh, rule, right? Yeah. Just to point out a bit of a difference, there was a period mm-hmm. where the ruler of our country was a good ruler. Yeah. Muslim, mm-hmm. but he was a good ruler. Fair. Fair, right. And there was a tax on all farmers. I, I don't know the numbers, but let's just throw some numbers out there. 20% of your produce needs to come to the sultan, okay. to, to the ruler. Fair enough. Fair enough. For you to live. Then. For you to live. And, That's and, your payment and, for being under the protection tax, of this land. Your yeah. Tax. tax. Yeah, tax. Just like we have tax now. Yep. Everybody except church land. Christian Orthodox church land. He said, church land of the opposite religion, you're no tax on you, right? He's respecting the other religion. Respecting the other religion. Okay, fair enough. As you should. Here comes our own religion and finds a great business opportunity that I'm seeing the the, um, results of today, okay? In real estate. Starting to bear the fruits now, huh? Yeah. They went to our farmers and they said, yo, bro, Listen, you got to pay 20% tax on every orange and lemon and olive that you produce. But if you register your land on my name, just give me the land. We'll make a contract, a lease, a 99-year lease Mm -hmm. that that land is going to be run only by you and your family for 99 years. But it's under my name. So technically, we don't have to pay the tax anymore. Yeah. Right? I don't want anything, the church says. Genius. Except the land Except in 100 years. <laughs> so before if you, you know it, it, you'll be dead. Oh, and guess what land? Coral Bay. Oh, wow. right. The best land. The, the best, best land the best on land. the island, bro, they took. And the majority land uh, holder of our country today is the Christian Orthodox Church. You know? So that, that's, that's a difference. Just Not a only, nice little uh, contrast of religion. The that that just shows you real estate that just agent shows you on our, the island. Yeah, that just shows you how short-sighted our people are here. Yeah, with everything. With everything, because no, right now so the so lease is about to expire. You know what, on what you said, the lease is about to expire. And so they're land. telling you, hey, do you want to sign another ninety-nine years, yeah. or do you want to buy for ridiculous money like the ownership of the land? Millions. Now. Yeah, 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 millions. yeah, yeah. You know, so Where it's a win-win for them. Yeah, for, for absolutely. Yeah. They're, they're a business. But they're, you know they're what it run is, as a business. It's not only that they're sh- short sighted, yeah. they're also selfish. Very. Yes. So they're thinking, you know what, bro? They're not. If I'm not thinking of tr- my. If you are a true, true man. Family man. Yeah, family. You, you need wouldn't to, do that. Yeah, you won't do That's, that. You wouldn't bro. do that. That's yeah. your legacy like, for you know the next what? I'm generation. Gonna, I'm going to take the gold now and fuck the next generation, bro. And that's what's happened. <laughs> that's what happened. Yep. Yeah, yeah. It so was... until our dad's generation, they were good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but after that, everything got f- fucked up, and yeah. there's no land left. In yeah. fact, uh, where we come from, probably we own the less land. The if you take, uh, yeah, it's getting there. Like it's, getting it's a, there. it's a close. It's getting close to fifty fifty. If you take away the actual local uh, owners real and foreign estate owners. agents that are uh, from where we come from, mm-hmm. personally speaking, I mean, I mean, as individuals. Yeah, we don't own land like we used to. No, no, and, it, and it's near impossible for us w- trying to do it with a normal There's job. There's no way you, you can can't. Do it anymore, you can't bro. even you survive gotta, with. You gotta live in anymore. a cave. The only, yeah. thing, the only thing we you have to can sacrifice aff- the everything. only thing we can afford right now is honestly what, some shitty pieces of land 
in the middle of nowhere with no road access, no facilities, no nothing, yep. and probably not enough zoning for you to do anything. Yeah, yeah. And that's what you can afford with a mortgage. There's no, with a mortgage. Uh, there's no, no, nothing, nothing. nothing. It's nothing. just barren land. Just barren fucking land, bro. Yeah, man. In the middle of nowhere. And that would be great if that I was is. a fucking and horse. And like, and like uh, Chris just mentioned, they won't. You can't even build on it. You no, can't yeah, even get yeah. permits to build like it. Yeah. So what are you, what's the point yeah. to do so what with it? You can put a little shed, bro. Put a tent. Go. Put tent there. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, well, I'm technically, go to my tent. if you put it on wheels, you're good. Yeah, technically. Yeah, yeah if you don't put a, founda- a permanent yeah. foundation, yeah. that's right. That is right. I'll put a permanent foundation with wheels on it. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, you bro. know, that's how Loophole. religion kind of shaped our country a little bit, you know, through greediness. One, of, one of the biggest Just uh, like sins, everywhere, bro. Right? Yeah, bro, obviously. Bro, have you seen Listen, how... Listen, you could say this about the Catholic Church. Every church. Bro, every, have you seen yeah, yeah, how yeah. lucky, Amer- like, how luck, <laughs> luckily they got so big, America? I'm talking about scale-wise, land-wise. Have you seen what happened and how well, they... the expansion. Yeah. yeah it's, bro, it's a huge country, bro. Bro, America. they bought Alaska for like 7 million or something like that. They bought Texas for 15 million. Right. At the time. At the time. Which is like a few billion today, I guess. A couple of billion now, which is nothing. You know? Bargain, bro. Mm-hmm. Biggest, uh, uh, Russia regrets it for, because it, they, they bought it from, they bought Alaska from Alaska Russia. from Russians. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, for like peanuts, bro. And they like all the, all the way up here now and here and here and here and blah, blah, blah. And then they, the, and France owned a huge part mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. they just took all, bro. Yeah, just in in a matter of years, they were like the biggest, one of the biggest countries in the world. Yeah, well, they're, they're also state. one of the newest countries. They are. Yeah. Yeah. I think you're talking about this. I don't know if it's the civil war, but one of these wars of uh, you know Texas Rangers and the West Captain and America, the North and South. It was North. That was South. civil then. The civil huh? war. The civil war. Yeah, you know, is it was a big history behind that. Shane Gillis loves talking about it on his mm-hmm. podcast. He is. Uh, he's a bit autistic. Who else really, loved the know? Civil oh, yeah. War, Kiri? Sorry? Who else loved the Civil War? Who else loved the Civil War? Oh, um, uh, not Joey. Oh, uh, uh, what? I don't know. Iron Man. No. <laughs> he loved the Civil War. Oh, oh. Come on, Kiri. Come on, bro. Um, Richard. Richard, bro. What the fuck, Richard. Man? Richard. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, she sat there that was with a brain cigar. Yeah, 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 yeah. Monica. You love the Civil War. Smelling his cigars. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> talking about friends and religion, it's funny how casual, um, what, were the, what were they? Monica and Ross? Jewish, uh, half Jewish, Jewish, right? Half Jewish, half Jewish. But they had the whole Hanukkah episode. They yeah. had the whole candlesticks. Years yep. and you know, years dreadle, ago. Dreadle, dreadle, dreadle. You know, yeah. so it's uh, that's a big religion over in the states. Yeah, that's one we yep. don't know of. Here, we don't do we? know. We're learning about it now. To yeah. be fair, yeah, yeah, we're getting uh, we're getting a whiff of it. Yep, uh, it's not far away. No, uh, and they're coming by the numbers. Yep. So fair enough. We're gonna learn about it. I was thinking about something throughout the week that I wanted to bring up to the podcast, but obviously I completely forgot about it. Make notes next time. Make notes. Next so time. J. Cole, Drake, and Kendrick Lamar. Oh, they, there's a beef beef between Huge them, right? Beef. Wait, wait, what's going on right now? There's yeah, rap yeah. battles. Rap battles. Yeah? Yeah. Are they rapping about God? Yeah, it's about religion. Yeah. Are they really? No. <laughs> Cause we're talking he's about just, religion here. No, he's, also, he's switching. So there's know? beef with them. I'm not I'm not really up to the thing up with to it. date with it so yeah. it's basically um dre with j cole they're together drake sorry drake fuck you know don't ever make that mistake again i, 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 thought I misheard you. with uh j cole together okay uh, versus kendrick kendrick's uh, good uh, sorry j cole is good I kendrick's love, really love, good yeah, as yeah. well yeah. you know so f- i don't know what the yeah, i'm with about. you don't mention the third anyway yeah <laughs> i'm with you on that yeah. But anyway, uh, bigger news though, you might like, I don't know if you've heard this, but you're going to love this. What? Or I don't know if you're going to love this. It's a little bit sad. What? So Eminem mm. announced his new album. I saw The something. Death of Slim Shady. Oh, is this his last album or? Slim Shady. Slim Shady. He's killing off that character. 
because he's know, killed him off. So hold on. I think he's going to talk about how he did it. Yeah. Yeah, he's killed him the off. The end of him. So yeah, we can expect this shaving. to be like quite a hard... So, yeah. yeah, yeah. So His we last gave, bit of so yeah. hard shit. So we left yeah? with Eminem and Marshall, yeah. Yeah. right? There's going to be a bit of suicidal mentions for in there for sure. sure. Uh-huh. You know, when it comes to Eminem His mum's going to be back. Yeah. yeah. Bro, yeah. what are you talking about? Kim and everyone. It's going to be Bring on the Bring on everyone, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, you know that there's a really, really... I think... I don't know if you spoke about this before, but um, there's a really cool video. You should check it out if you haven't seen it, Kiri. Mm. Uh, it's with uh, Drake. No, Dre. What the fuck is wrong Dr. with me Dr. Dre? Today? It's with Dr. Dre and Eminem. It's yeah. called... Um, uh, it's with his uh, conscience. Oh, uh, yeah, I've wrong. seen um, yeah, yeah, Guilty yeah. conscience? Guilty, Guilty conscience. conscience. Yes, yes. When, it, when he's talking yeah, yeah. Yeah, on both sides. Yeah, yeah. It's a great Plus, song. I love the beat. I love, you know, it's, uh-huh. it's, 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 a, great, it's a great song. You see that they remastered the beats he released a new song M with that beat remastered. No, no great, no. great. Is it? All right, great that's beat. Exciting. Yeah, put it on after. Uh, so yeah, put it yeah, on yeah. afterwards. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's. So what's the beef about though? How did it? Well, like, basically, uh, who's calling out? J Cole who? and Drake mentioned that they uh, them two and Dr- and uh, um, Kendrick are the top three. And Ken- so J Cole said that. Yeah. That these it, three. It, no. So in the song with um, Drake and J Cole, yeah. they mention yeah. that. These two and Kendrick are the top okay. three. And then Ken- Kendrick said, no, I'm here by myself. Okay. And that's where the beef started. All that's right. all I kind of know. Yeah. It's, yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm better than you. Hey, no, it's, not. Selling, oh, I'm it's selling records a little bit. Yeah, and they're not yeah, as yeah. aggressive as they used to be back I, in the 90s. I don't give a 90s. shit about that. Talk to me about Diddy. What's going on with Diddy? Are there any updates? I don't know. Bro. No? Don't you know. heard anything? I don't know. I don't know. Listen, bruv. Let's break down the pattern officially, right? Mm-hmm. Every time there's something going on that's very important. Around the world. Around the world. There's the a distraction. Media distracts There's us. a celebrity that did something. So when yeah. something I mean, else is happening. pretty hap- bad what he did. When something else is happening, they'll if let us did. know again. They'll mm-hmm. resurface everything. Because it dies down. It comes back up. It dies down. That's just how the world works now, bro. Yeah. Well, yeah. It was like all the wars that started. Exactly. When the yeah, Russian war started, time. that's all we were hearing about. Like, all we were hearing about. Now you hardly hear anything about exactly, it anymore. Bro. So it's yeah. all timed perfectly. Really. Mm. It's all monitored it's all like understood to a, a more, much deeper level than what we think so what's going on with that we know what we know everyone knows about diddy yeah like, what's going on behind the scenes though man i think they're trying to cut a deal um, yeah, i course. was listening to a podcast the other day that they said this has been done before i can't remember with who uh, i think they said also with uh, epstein yeah it was some, yeah, something is... similar he's like look we'll, we'll arrest you but you give us information on the down low. We'll just confirm what we already know. We'll do it for the show. Let it's the world deals. come it's down. It's business. Yeah, and in three years. It's actual business. We'll say five years, but in two and a half basically, years, we'll let you out. Basically, something. And those two and a half years are going to be comfortable. Don't yeah, worry about yeah. it, you know? So, so basically, um, something's illegal unless you have money. Yeah, but that's, come on, that's obvious. It's such bullshit. That's though, always right? been obvious. Such shit. That's, that is, why not? Yeah, you know? man. What, what does uh, Rastafari say? All laws are illegal. Uh, every yeah. law, every, every law. government is illegal. Uh, every uh, law is illegal. So, you know, it's if true. you have money, you have government power. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. Right? At the end of the day. Basically. Uh, you you just got to be, a, a, I don't know good if good guy is the word, but you got to be kind of a righteous guy like our mayor, where he stepped in and he's like, guys, it's just let's allocate the funds correctly. Mm-hmm. Nobody's gonna pocket anything. Ninety six, no. uh, what's that? Uh, uh, projects. Projects. Ninety six projects. Ninety six projects. Yes, yeah. and still going. Because all he in, did in, in nine years. It's not like he had more money, access to more money. All he did is he used he, the he, money correctly. Yeah, he yeah. he gathered used the money up, for what it was for. He regrouped the whole fucking departments he and fired he fired everyone yeah, who had to be fired. No one's gonna be pocketing any money here. We all have salaries. The money that's coming in is going to go be put to work. Yes. And he's proved that. Yeah, he has. You know what I mean? Well, but the wh- previous one's in jail for... for yeah, for that's stealing. my point. Bro, he gave back... You ready? The previous one gave back 800000 Ah, so, so how what, much did you steal, motherfucker? So that's the deal they gave. Imagine... 800000 Bro, the guy we have today probably changed the whole neighborhood with that money. Yeah. You he know did. what I'm talking no, he about? Did. Bro, the, the university that he's building, the, uni- the American University of Beirut that mm-hmm. he's building, everything together with the parking, with the facilities, with it's only $40 million. 
40. 40 yeah. million. Imagine how much money you can do. What what you can do with all that money, with 800,000. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? You can change a whole little area. Payments. That's, you've confused me. Why? This university costing 40 million. Yeah. 40 million. That's yeah. nothing. Is it? Yeah, it's 40 million How big bro, is it? for a new construction of a university. It's yeah. good money. Okay. It's very good. It's fair but money. we're talking about it's going to be in the top universities. And it's I not think, local standards. I think number 30. No, so it's gonna it's be, not local standards. It's going to no. be much better. Though, I think no. in the. Th no, globally, it's like number 30 or 40 oh, or something. Wow, like. okay. Yeah, we're talking yeah. about. So we've got some real shit going on now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And now it's real he's, money. Bro, now he's building an American. Uh, Medical Medical uh, School or University school. Yeah, Right yeah. next to the fucking Oh yeah I heard hospital. the teaching uh, yeah. Teaching, teaching hospital yeah. teaching Next hospital. to the hospital No it's called It's, a teaching, it's a teaching hospital, hospital. Because it operates like a hospital at maybe a smaller scale, so uh, scale of seriousness mm -hmm. And students so, so they can practice Bro it's yeah. little On, things Like our Our, um, our Main yeah. hos um, General hospital yeah. Was built 31 years Bro, ago. Oh, it's ancient. Yeah. Right? yeah. Th it's and too it hasn't small. Been upgraded. It's, not, it's terrible. But not only that, when it was built 30 years ago, it was built for the, the amount of population that was 30 years ago. Yeah, it's that's doubled. What I'm doubled. Easy doubled. Easy. Easy doubled. You know? Yeah. And it's not like we ain't got land, people. If you come here, you'd be like, bruv, what are you guys Yes, but like Chris <laughs> mentioned earlier, the church owns most of it. <laughs> well, yeah, of course. Well, and they're not that willing to just yeah, but give it to the people. The next town over where I work just got an approval to increase their uh, mall size because of the increased mm. amount of population. Oh, the one in... Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They, wow. they, they're going to increase the mall. Well, you, you know, know what, and they, though, and they, they got that massive hotel right opposite the mall. Oh, now, casino. It? It's a casino. Casino hotel. Huge. But not only casino. that, they, I think this was uh, planned from before because... But look at the area they've picked. Yes. The scale there. Oh, the, no, they, they definitely There's have the room. four sides. There's yeah, room yeah, yeah, there. They, they could build a, another three right yeah, there. Bro, it's like our airport here. You know that whole road basically. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. yeah but the parking's so been uh, like doubled, Ex right? Bro, Not they put double, a but yeah, they've station extended. Too. Yeah, they put a petrol station. You see, it's new. changing. Mm -hmm. Shit's changing. Yeah, man. And uh, it's all about allocating money correctly. So if we're gonna look at this from a religious point of view, church makes a lot of money. Yeah, maybe you can they... help people and have a real influence, mm -hmm. bro, you, around your community yeah, as a yeah. church or a. And this you know, is... you can actually help. But People. this is what I was saying is my problem with all this, the religion, because it's run as a business. Yeah. Okay. Because, because the whole point of religion is to help each other, right? Bro. And if they've got all that money to easily help so many people why are they not using it why are they asking more money, right. more money? so yeah. what did you just say that they're running it like a, a business right so what was the first one of the first governments established a form of government religion priests yeah but that priests was th that's, and higher... th that's not that wasn't the so, intention so, yeah. it was church and but then no, state they, they, they were the government right yeah so now no, they're they were, separated they were... but really they're not they haven't separated yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> You know? Is my just to see the they are the government. Yeah, just yeah. to see what what class we're talking about. What, we went to school, right? We finished school at eighteen. We had to go to the army, right? Mm -hmm. Except me, no. Ex <laughs> <laughs> except if you declared that you were going to follow the path of a priest, Aha. right? So then they you tell had a you, few exceptions. Yeah, if you're you had gay? a few. If you were gay at the time, if can you, you were, be a priest uh, if you can't grow a beard? Uh, if you were a different religion. Yes, you can. Yeah. yeah. Um, a different religion, gay, and if you wanted to be a priest. Yes. Or crazy. Or, or physically unable. Yeah, right? yeah, these are obvious. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> so we finished school and it's my good. neighbor... The Holy Spirit. <laughs> my neighbor, the same age, he didn't go to the army. He went to Greece to yeah. study to be a priest. So for the time that I'm in the army, he's away studying. Growing in, a beard. You know, he couldn't. He still can't. <laughs> ah, <laughs> he, he's 30 years old. He still can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when yeah. puberty finally kicks in, he yeah, might. No, yeah, yeah. He's a him. big boy as well. You know, so anyway, but the difference is I come back. Sorry, I finished the army. Some of my peers went to study. Some others like me, we went to work, right? Mm -hmm. He comes back with a Mercedes. Of course. A new Mercedes at the time. Mm -hmm. Robes. Okay. A fat salary. Nice. And a job of just going to the two churches of our community and just just yeah. just being all there. of a sudden you're favored. You know? So now he's part of the community. He stops by every other house every now and then. He's at the coffee shop. He's going to the church in the Which mornings. Most of the time, uh, because like we said, we're a very religious place, 
Yeah. It's, it's a all good free. Thing. Yeah, but I mean, it's all free. Oh, yeah, he, he doesn't pay for shit. Yeah. I think. Yeah. Plus, he's got a salary. Bro, oh, they, yeah. Didn't they Plus get a discount at the restaurant? House, you know, yes. it's got, huh? they've they, got a house, a car. It's all from the church. They've got right? a discount at the restaurant we used to work. Yeah. yeah. A big one. Very nice discount. They used to sometimes, fair enough, though, if it wasn't for the pub publicity reasons behind it, because it always used to come with a camera crew, but yeah, anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they would bring <laughs> the, the priest. The whole point is God to see it, in your opinion. Yeah. Yeah. Why you got a camera? So the priest was bringing a group of kids and we would uh, do the whole thing for free, the restaurant. The owner was good like that, right? Yeah. Uh, like a group of 12 kids, 15 kids with a priest. So, you know, that that's the power they have. Mm. They have that power. Use yeah. it. Yeah. They have the economic power and everything, but... Yeah, they don't. They're just uh, growing their own pockets at the end of the day, just yeah. like everyone We're not else. even going to go into the other shit that they've been accused of today. Oh, no, don't even open those doors, We're just bro. talking just about you, money. That's just, just fucked just up. Yeah. That is just, just messed up shit. Just watch a documentary about, you know... Um, Religion? What? No, uh, what's the place? The Vatican? The Vatican. The Vatican. And, and yeah, and that's it. You'll get exactly... You'll get or watch a few Joe Rogan episodes when he's yeah. talking about it. But that. you know what is... It, what is the Vatican, there's such a shame there. They have such a massive library, an underground library. Bro, they have the of biggest. Of the world's history, of all the shit they wanted to suppress from the people. Dude, things Bro, from. Bro, they've got it in there, man. Everything. Everything. It is the. You know? If, if, love to go have a look down oh, there. Oh, man. Please, I would love please to Please don't go cancel there. me. I've been for to this. the Vatican and please. I've seen it all. Yeah. What you're allowed to see. Please don't cancel me. And it was huge. Yeah. The Vatican is like. Hitler's testicle. Hitler's like testicle. Everything in <laughs> all the all bad, the, all the know, information yeah. and the evilness is just living in there, bro. You Whatever. know that that all supposedly exists. It does. It does. Supposedly, they've got yeah. it in a cup. Uh, I mean, I mean, uh, egg cup. In case they want an offspring of him, like or no, a clone. It's, no, it's the seed of evil. That's Th that, that's if you believe that he actually died and he's not. So, he well, didn't he, go he, to he, Argentina yeah, or somewhere. Now, yeah, now, yeah but I mean. You saw on Joe Rogan as well, and talking about in Argentina. Him going to South America. Yeah, yeah. And they like everyone speaking German. A lot of those people went to South uh, America. A lot of them did. And they a also lot of made did. communities. Some of them made secret communities. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot of secret history behind that part of uh, the Second World War. Oh yeah. Uh, where they went to South America. Oh yes. Um, so many of them got away. Most of them got away with it. The they're guys that made the biggest. Oh, the Americans hired half of them. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're rocket scientists. And yeah. I don't know. Come, you're good. Come this here. Don't, let's not waste so your brain. Yeah. You're, you're yeah. the guy that your granddad worked with. Yeah, yeah? that's all right. Yes, come. Uh, come. Uh, everyone Give me the did cheat it, codes. Though. Give me the cheat codes. The Chinese did it too. The Russians did it too. Yeah, yeah. They, they, they were all chasing these scientists at the time. <laughs> and um, yeah, so let's finish off on religion and science. Mm -hmm. There's, I think there's an increased number of people that kind of accept they're both in the same. It used to be... A big battle of one versus the other. No, it's, yeah. I, if you if you really look into it, you'll start seeing that it's so similar. Bro. Yeah. It's yeah. just different. The, the whole point, though, is to have an open mind yeah. about both. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. You can't, like, because science uh, revolves around facts. Mm. Yeah. Uh, ab about uh, tangible uh, things that no, you proving can test. It. Yeah. About the yeah, fact, that's a fact of you proving should, it. Exactly. That's whereas science. science. Whereas religion is all about faith. faith. Yeah. You've got to feel it. Yeah, but there's this is what I'm saying. We're very naive on this subject because mm -hmm. I promise you, bro, there's religious people out there that will break down the facts. Oh, scientists. In oh, a sure. scientific yeah. way. Yeah, yeah. And Dude. you will be gob, god, god smacked. Gob smacked. Darwin. <laughs> Darwin believed in God. Like, yeah. And he, you know, he came up with the whole evolution thing. That we're carrying today. But he yeah. didn't come up with it to prove that there is no No, God. no, it's just it's observing nature. It's what he noticed. It's his observation yeah. in nature. That's what he saw. Yeah. And, and we yeah. just took it as proof of, oh, no, God doesn't no, God exist. exist. No, we're yeah. not saying he, he does or doesn't. Each to their own. If you believe what you believe, good for just you. Just don't, don't be in our soul. That's no, the message. No, this is the message. Don't kill the person that don't believe in the same God as you. Or yeah. don't hate on him. Don't hate on yeah. him. That's it. Yeah. Otherwise, don't make just, anyone suffer. You're what did God be saying, man? A hypocrite. You're just an a eye hypocrite. for an eye? An eye for an eye. Yeah. Makes the whole world blind. I, I, yeah. Bro, bro. I, I, an eye for an eye, right? That's yeah. what, again, Rastafarian, right? So. In Gandhi, Buddhism. Yeah, but again, same shit. See what I'm saying? Same eye, shit. For, eye for an eye, like yeah, yeah, yeah. don't do onto others what you don't want done onto you. Yeah, you know, basically, that's, that's also, yeah. I, I just put all that into don't be an arsehole. Yeah, 
Yeah, basically. Yeah, in, your, in your head, that's that's what it means. Yeah, exactly. that's what it translates to. It's basically peace and love, bruv. You, yeah. Like, Take uh, it easy. It stop doesn't hating. mean you have to be a hippie, though. No, like, just, just stop don't, hating. Don't, um, fanatize. don't become a fanatic. If you want to be a hippie, anything. though, you can be. Yeah. You know, go out, hug them trees. It's all good. Uh, bro, I hug trees every time I'm out in nature because I love the feeling from it. Doesn't mean hippie. I'm a hippie, though. Well, what about? I mean, I'm saying we got something against hippies. I also might do it? my my cross if I pass the church. It doesn't mean I'm a, like. I'm just saying, like, uh, it's all. Yeah. I'm I'm taking all the goodness from all of them and trying to see what's a uh, life of Pi. Yeah. Huh? Kind of. Have you seen that movie mm -hmm. with the tiger? There's other animals there, you oh. dirty bitch. That was the main one. <laughs> tiger on a boat. Rawr, rawr. Rawr. Kind of, that was a kind bad of tiger, tiger too. Tiger, yeah, that, was, that was, you know, I know what tiger that was. That was a tiger from Kung Fu Panda. Yeah, yeah. Angelina Jolie, you bro. Know what, She's bro. hot as a tiger. I'll tell you who the yeah. hottest character, <laughs> bro. The hottest character of all times on any, any, any animation. Jessica Rabbit. Uh, yeah, yeah, but I have one more. Uh, is it Jasmine from Hercules? No. 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 Meg. What's her name? Meg. 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 Meg was sex, bro. Oh, she was bro, so bro, <laughs> Meg, no. Meg was the embodiment of sex. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, like, yeah. if you, she, everything, her, all her moves, well, she's friends everything with, she's was friends sexual. With, she's friends with the devil. Yeah, true. But also, she's yeah. Mediterranean, so maybe that appeals to you as well. And I think that's a good one to end up. Yeah, you know? yeah, Don't be friends with the devil. Yeah, Otherwise, yeah. you're going to end up like Meg from yeah. Hercules. Yes. You know, and you're going to well, be... Out for her in the end. Hey, yeah, this, you know, you know what I mean. You know, so I guess there's only a few Hercules out there. Though, yeah, so I'm just saying. No, no. <laughs> That's episode 19, everyone. Yeah. Thank you for being here. <laughs> Don't forget to do all the shit. Yeah, See you next you. time. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye, -bye. <laughs> Done it the wrong way. <laughs>